Game on here in Houston. And immediately it's a direct ball towards Cavallini. You'll see a lot of that tonight. Abramos did mention to us that Maxi Arruti will play more like a playmaker tonight. I like it. And you see right there. Pico. He's got space. He's got Lassiter at the far post. Rodriguez top of the box. Took a deflection. Crapo spilled it right to Rodriguez and he slams it home. The kind of break you need. And Memo Rodriguez smashes in the finish. It is 1 0 Houston Dynamo. Hey, this is where I've been a little bit critical of Papa Pico just settling for a cross. But he picks it at the right time because Ari Lasseter is coming across that near post. So the only thing that the goalkeeper Maxime Capo can do is just try to get a piece of it. And this is why I love Memo Rodriguez in that 10 spot. He drifts in late. He's in the right spot at the right time and strikes it. It's Gaspar now getting the start at the right back position. Isado, ball whipped in, a paw on it. It's a chance to tie it up. It's blocked, and it's a huge block by Zarek Valentin, who goes to ground to Durvan, deny Cavallini. Still Vancouver, and it'll be a corner. That was a lot of the talk on the pregame show. That's a delicate ball that skips into the pace and space of a Rudy shot is saved at the near post by Crapo, and then cleared by Vancouver. Coming up at home. Is down the road, HoustonDynamo.com. To the far post of Rudy, pulled out, lashed it in. Oh, what a hit! Off the side volley. It's maxi time here in Houston. Talked about it a few minutes ago, Glenn. If the Dynamo could get one more before halftime, but this is not what I was expecting. We talk about Major League Soccer and the quality of goals. Watch, he never takes his eyes off it, but he doesn't swing for the fences. Kids at home, take note. He makes sure he gets good contact with no less confidence for sure. I do not envy Major League Soccer defenders. Super drama in both those games today. Cross oh. comes in, oh, just over the top of the outside of the foot and wide from Memo Rodriguez. Good early delivery again. Oh, Lassiter, now what can he do here? Here's Ari Lassiter, he's gotta make something happen. Cuts in on his left, bends in, oh. off the crossbar. Oh. More of that Ari Lassiter. Towards the third for the Dynamo. Oh my goodness, Glenn. We talked about it the whole first half, how aggressive he's been. He's been a different Ari Laster taking players on. This time he cuts inside, hits it nearly perfect. Just enough bend, but not quite enough dip. Love it from Ari Laster, but I talked to her. So Matias Vera, Tyler Pasher now are getting some last minute instructions from Paul Rogers. But here's Vancouver to try and come back in this one. And I believe Maric got a hand on that. That is a big save from Marco Maric. One back after Lasseter rattled the crossbar. Yeah, this is where you got to be real. And that's not how you're going to do it. It's Cavallini. It's a chance here. There's a lot of bodies in net. It's now 2-1 to one in Vancouver, who's been outplayed all night long, is all of a sudden back in this. Debar Casado has made it 2-1 to one now in the 80th minute. Well, and this is one of the things that may come from trying to play out of the back. Boniac Garcia just takes a poor touch, gives it away, and you got to give Casado some credit. Maric off the goal kick, that does it. Full three points for the Houston Dynamo. A third win here on the year. All of them coming at home.